Hello. Hi, everyone. We are in a new location this Friday afternoon. Grapevines. We're at We're a little big, retreat. We are. We are in, it's technically Calistoga. We're at a wedding. Do you need me to open that for you? No, I can do it. Okay. I mean, I was a server for many years. I've opened a lot of wine. I, I would love it if you want to open this wine for us. I was trying to give you, we got into our room late, so we are just, but look who's here. It's Bruce. Say hi, hi Bruce. Everyone. So we are up in Calistoga, which is right near Napa Valley at um, a beautiful hotel for a very special wedding. This is uh, my best friend's son. I've known him since he was a small child and this is his really special wedding weekend so we're super excited to share that and um, you know we always like to do shows when we're on the road because it's fun so we are here we've got our own they flew in the grapevine for the set which was really nice and um, Violet's here and Bruce and Camellia is Camelia literally doesn't know if she's coming or going. She yeah. landed from France last night about 9 p.m. and um, had to turn around and get on an That's early amazing. flight this morning. Taste it? Oh, wow. Thank you. So this is the wine they make here. This is the wine made right behind you. Wow. And this is crazy. Been Look at that rich for color. Nine years. It's Ooh, it's 2015. Nice. It's called mm -hmm. Helic. It's crazy. This is my dad's kind of wine. Yeah, when I smell wine like Full this, body. because, I, it, I mean, you smell the big fruit. That's like a big fruit bomb. California Cabernet. Mm -hmm. He this liked a like big Donald. fruit bomb. Mm -hmm. Yes. He would taste mm -hmm. the Italian wines and he'd go, I don't get it. And he's Italian. Yeah, he's Italian. <laughs> but he liked a big California Cab. And that's, that's actually Are these really tenons? nice. Uh, mm -hmm. no. What are those called? Well, they call them the, the that's legs, just, but they don't really mean anything. No, yeah, but the yeah. legs are the drips, I thought. Yeah, the yeah, legs are the drips. But it's just the glycerin. Oh, the sediment. No, oh, she's yeah, talking sediment. about the sediment. Oh, yeah. the sediment. Okay. Yeah. Um, so we have, we have two great deals today. So I'm just going to explain it quickly so that Violet can get ready because our um, our little welcome dinner starts at 5 p.m. So, we, oh, look who's here. Look who else needs to use her skincare. Oh, I do. We're all fresh. I don't have makeup, but yeah. I have hair. Yeah. Okay, good, good, good. Okay, so we have, you guys, the four-piece skin. Can you hold these up? Absolutely. We have the four-piece skincare kit, which is the Everyday Cleanser, the Ageless. They got that right. Oh, you know what, honey? They're both. Here, no, they're not. Did I flip okay. Facebook? Did that work? No, because Facebook isn't flip. Let me flip it. Flip it. Okay, Facebook, you're in for something crazy. In you're a in second. for a treat. Here we go. There we go. Um, yeah, we're confused. Okay, so. No, I got it right. Good. Let me just. <laughs> I'm, I'm just closer. Upside down. I'm Whoa. closer, yeah. She's upside down and she's everywhere because she, she's been yeah. around everywhere. the world. Yeah. Okay, so the four-piece skincare kit, these are our best sellers. The Everyday Cleanser, which Violet left in the bathtub. Can I <laughs> mind grabbing it? <laughs> Wait, someone said, Violet, how are your bangs doing? So I did go to the salon. They couldn't fix the two in the middle that were really short, but that's why I might have to leave early, make sure I get those suckers dry before I yeah. go to this event. Because they can't be whiling out tonight, you know? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, but I'm able to tuck them a little bit. No, no. It looks good now. I, yeah, the salon, like, figured it out. I'm all for the curtain bay. Mm -hmm. It looks great on you. But I also think what we're doing today is cool because a lot of times you guys ask, where do I start? What order do I use everything? And today I'm going to be putting it all on so you get the real-life tutorial of the order in which you can use mm -hmm. all these things and you can see how I apply them. Exactly. Yeah. So we are going to start with the amazing Everyday Cleanser. Mm -hmm. It's been 15 years since we date. Oh, thank you, sweetie. 15 years since we debuted this product. Do you want to come sit up here in the middle? Mm, it's okay. Um, I'll sit on the. Look at that. Oh, look at that. Yeah. It's so beautiful. Look at that. Oh, it's it? so nice. It's been 15 years since we debuted this cleanser. I've never used anything else. This is my favorite cleanser. 
I just used this in the bathtub, just so you know. We're starting with a fresh face. Okay, oh, so you don't need the washcloth for this. Okay. I mean, I can simulate it. No, you don't need to. You've got it's kind of hurting my booty. Simulation. Here we go. Okay. Yeah, until I don't back. Don't do that. Don't do that. Okay, so don't there's no sodium lauryl sulfate. It's coconut cleansers. They're very gentle. Gets the job done. You can take off your eye makeup with it. Did you take off your eye makeup in the bathtub? Of bath course tub? I did. Okay, just check yeah. under the eye because just want to make sure you got that mascara off. Look, nothing. Okay, good. All right. Nothing. So this is a fresh face girl who got the beautiful antioxidants and the nice uh, Gentle cocoa cleanser. butter cleansers. Okay, just to wipe my lips. I would like to exfoliate them. Okay. The second thing Toy. that we would do if you were going to exfoliate would be the peach exfoliating cleanser. Do you want a hand demonstration? It's so great. Yeah. If you want your skin to feel like a soft little baby's butt. It's a butt, little soupy like this. And go like this, apply it. You put it on dry skin. Put it on dry skin. So literally my dry hand like this is, that would be what we do. Like mm -hmm. that and then you leave it for two to five minutes. Just make sure to leave it because what happens is that all of the actives get working in there once you leave it on and then you wet your fingertips after two to five minutes, you do a little scrub-a-dub and you have the softest skin ever. It's the beta hydroxy acids and they- You can that, like feel it working. Yeah, hand. so yeah, I'm just gonna just wipe this off and then I'm gonna wash your hand. We had, we had something burst on the way up in, mm. in transit. Um, okay, so the beta hydroxy acids are going to break down the dead tissue between the cells, and then you wrote, you scrub a dub dub. Jojoba beads, they're round, they are polished, they are not, and the and the peach kernels, polished peach kernels, not going to tear your skin, but they're getting down deep in the oil dirt makeup. Sandy used to use this all the time. Oh my God, I use the peach when I got out of the pool and it makes your whole body soft mm -hmm. as a baby. So true. Yeah. Trula wants to know where Bunny is, Chameleon. She Bunny. is with her very special friend, Babysitter. Yeah. She's she tall. loves her. She when loves I, her. When she arrived today, Bunny's tail started wagging. She but loves her I got her to see her for 10 hours and it was great. So then I'd wet my fingertips like this. Mm-hmm. Melody White Fortune said, I need this entire line. Oh, okay. well, I, well, <laughs> well, we have a deal today. Okay, so you guys, the four piece kit is normally 180, it's $190, and we're doing it today for 110. So it's 42% off. It's four pieces it's the Everyday Cleanser, the Ageless Serum, the Bioactive Moisturizer, and the Eye Cream. The six piece, that's 42%, but the six piece, you get two extra pieces. You get the calming toner and the peach exfoliating cleanser. And that is gonna bump that up to $270 value and you get it home for 135. It's 50% off. That's 50% off. 50% like, off. Wait, that's, that's crazy. So it's a value of almost, I'm gonna do some quick math. It's a value of basically $80 more, correct? 190 plus 270. $90. 70 No, $80 more. No. It's 70. It's a value of oh. $80 more than the four. The six-piece kit oh. is a value of $80 more than the four-piece kit. And, you and it's only $15 more. $25. $25 <laughs> more. <laughs> She's actually really good at math. I am. Not right, right, right now. I just she, jet lag. She literally just got home from France last night. She's so when you use the Everyday Cleanser as well, so you need to use the everyday cleanser as well when you use the peach exfoliating cleanser. I use the everyday cleanser to take off my makeup. So if you're wearing makeup, I'd use the everyday cleanser first to take off your makeup and then use this. But if you already have a clean face, just go straight in with the peach one. It, it's up to you. Some people use both. Some people use one or the other. My hand Some people so just soft. use one. It's, um, okay, let's move on to the next it's thing crazy. in the routine. Okay, wait, don't get my hair though. Hold on. Okay. Just put your face that way. This way? Well, no, just like this Okay, way. you yeah. just push me. <laughs> well, because I don't want to get my... This good, yep. Mom? Yeah, okay, good. here we go. We have the toner here. Calming toner. I think Look at go... this spa day. Look at this. Look at this toner. You know what you won't find in I'm our I'm being toner? excessive. That, what? You're, you're, that's a light spray twice a day for your father. 
Really? So. How much oh, does he yeah. use? He does he, like 12 to 14 feels pounds. feels so no, refreshing. He also, he squints his eyes when he does this. He goes, like, you know how men yeah, he does. always squint their eyes and yeah. they're really rough? Mm -hmm. So the calming toner, what you're not going to find in there, alcohol. You're also yes. not going to find witch hazel. Mm. You know, when I was a kid, we had this, um, God, what was it called? What was that toner called that we all used? Was it from Noxema? It was like, it would suck your skin so dry and it smelled so astringent, but we were like, oh, it's tightening your pores. It's good for you. It gets it clean. Wait. No, it's stripping the hell out of your skin. Charlene said that her 15-year-old grandson uses the cleanser. So oh, good. I think what's something to note about it is that like it truly is a universal cleanser. Like It works for all men, skin women. types, yeah. men, women, all age types I think a lot of the time when you have um like that sort of teenage skin that breakouts, has like an yeah. occasional breakout or a lot of breakouts yeah but a lot of the time you lean toward toward products that are marketed for that and they actually can be so drying for your skin and you think that's good because you're like yes dry all this out but I actually when I had really bad like really bad breakouts and some like discoloration as well um it it was not helpful for me to use those products I actually ended up really improving the texture and tone of my skin when I started kind of going back to the getting more like, balanced or organic non-toxic type yeah. of yeah. skincare um because it wasn't so drying and it actually like restores your skin with all of the right ingredients. When you use those like really stripping products, your skin is actually going to secrete more oil on its own. So you're using them because you want to dry out your, you know, skin if you have breakouts and things, but then it, you're telling your skin like, oh, there's no moisture left. And guess what? It gives you more oil, which yeah. defeats the purpose. So using balanced and clean, no chemicals. These are organic, certified, toxic free. Yeah. So that's why it's such a good it really is it's such a good universal. And these are our, these are six of our top sellers. I mean, there are more that I could put in here, of course, and it was hard to keep it to six, but I wanted to just do the four piece. I made these two, the extras, because we've never done a four piece with the everyday cleanser, the ageless serum, which we're going to get to next. Kay and said, then the bioactive and the eye cream. Kay said she loves the toner and it's one of the best products on the Suzanne Summers line. Thank you. We agree. It's really amazing. We agree. Okay, so Should after you tone on? your face, the reason we tone, we actually use our toner to open the pores to create a liquid, liquid highway, highway to get these incredible nutrients from your ageless serum and moisturizer into the I'm skin. jumping the gun. I'm too excited. This is the next product we're going to put on my face. Right? She's yeah. either number one or number two in sales on the website. Ageless. No, I meant the next one we're going to put on my face, mom. <laughs> business all the time one or two she's number one or number two seller that too that too um ageless serum this is the suzanne ageless serum i'm sorry to disappoint it's not an engagement ring <laughs> um, <laughs> yeah so this is the ageless serum i actually got this in florence on the ponte vecchio right before my grandmother's passing actually and um I was thinking of her because it was pretty expensive, and I thought, oh, well, screw it. I'll just get it because she used to do that all the she time. She used to buy herself She used to right? overspend and buy herself things, and I thought, I want to be part of a club. Wait. So, anyway. Liz. Ageless serum is going on now. The ageless... Eliza Antonio said, I use all of these every day for the last three years. I get so many compliments on my skin. It's so amazing. I'm 57, and my skin looks 35. Wow. Eliza, we love that. Um, so the Ageless Serum is loaded with sea algae, which has incredible nutrients. It helps to bring back the appearance of elasticity in your skin. So if you're looking to get that plump, get that bounce back. Sorry. <laughs> I said bounce and she did it. She bounced. <laughs> um, like a wreck. That is exactly why we love loading this product with sea algae. And we don't just bless it with a little bit of sea algae. We put a ton of sea algae in it. We're so loading you, her up. You're really going to feel the difference with this product. I often tell people this is the gateway into Suzanne Organics. Because if you're using a different cleanser and a different moisturizer, 
add this and you're gonna see and feel the difference in your skin in, a, in within a month. So this, we call this the gateway. Um, it is our number one and number two products are the Ageless Serum and the Bioactive Moisturizer. And you know, you can read these comments. There's a reason why. I always, if I'm gonna skip steps, I'm gonna use my Everyday Cleanser. I'm gonna use that Ageless Serum and the Bioactive Moisturizer. If I just get those three, I know I am good to go day or night. I also think with these, like you'll see, you'll see a difference shortly after you start using it, but I'm pretty sure cell turnover takes three weeks. Like your skin cells take three weeks to actually mm -hmm. change um, or like adapt to a new routine or product. So you'll really see like a month, but three mm -hmm. weeks. Yeah, it's three weeks. Time. It's also three weeks is the amount of time that it takes to create a new habit. So if you have some skincare habits that are not, thank you, that are not serving you well, give yourself three weeks to create a new habit. Just try adding that ageless serum to your routine. And within three weeks, if you do that, all of a sudden it's just going to be a normal part of your routine. And your skin will say, oh, thank you. Um, I used to pick my skin all the time, which is not great and you shouldn't do it, period. But... I would get scolded all the time for picking my skin, and I found out that you actually can pick your skin if you use a face wash after, because then it clears your skin of, the back of a lot of the bacteria. Well, Did no, you know no that? No one should be overpicking their skin. No, but if you have a pimple... It was pimple, like an anxiety disorder for you. But if you have a pimple, you can pick it if you just cleanse it afterward. You can gently... <laughs> ease something that's really dying to get Look, out. Look, my skin is so much okay, better. Okay, this I is the bioactive <laughs> moisturizer. <laughs> We're not recommending this you This is the bioactive ever. moisturizer. No, saying, this is do. homegirl number one. <laughs> She's very neutral. So this is what we recommend for if you kind of don't know where to start with, with moisturizers, this is a great place to start. This is like... She's the gold standard. She's the main squeeze. So you see it? See how I put on my moisturizer? Very it's demure. Okay. Also, oh, she's loaded with sea buckthorn berry. She's loaded with CoQ10. Look at this. It's Don't perfect, forget the decollete too. It's the perfect, how does everyone say that word? Decollete. Or decolletage. Dec 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 I, I say decolletage. Is it decollete? It's decollete. It's spelled, decolleté. it's French. I don't know how to say it. I'm Italian. Decollete. Anyway, it, okay. your chest just means your chest. It means this area, also your collarbones. And then what do we do that. when you're done? Do not wipe it on a towel. Here, always. I thought I was being scolded. <laughs> every, every time I put on a serum or a moisturizer, ba, 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 I do this, and then I do this, I do this, and then I go like this. And that is how I dry my hands on my hands. Valerie said, yeah, so you need a hands. serum plus moisturizer. I'm 70 and I'm noticing wrinkles. Yes, yes, you do. Because the serum is giving you a load of the anti-aging actives. So this has your sea algae and the African birch. Um, and this is to help target the appearance of fine lines and wrinkles. And as I said, to get the elasticity and the plumpness back to your skin. Your bioactive moisturizer is Lots for hydration. It. So you need the moisture as well. And especially as we age, you guys know you need, but you need balanced moisture. So that is, I love this bioactive moisturizer. I have used it for 15 years. To me, it's my perfect moisturizer. Yes, I can use a night cream at night and I love our targeted night cream. But when I travel, I, if I have a small bag, I have my everyday cleanser, my ageless serum and my bioactive. Also, because I was just, you know, every time I come on, I'm like, I'm in Korea, I'm in France. And those happen to be... Now you're in Napa. But those two places happen to be known for their skincare, like the French pharmacy yeah. or Korean skincare. So whenever I'm there, as you guys know, I tend to, you know, go in and do a little bit of research and see what the popular products are. And there's one, there's a retinol serum. Up on your knees so they can see. There's a retinol serum that is popular in, in France right now. Uh-huh. But the issue with retinol is that it dries out your skin so much. So if you are using anything that tends to be a little bit more drying, this is the perfect moisturizer to put on over because it doesn't have it doesn't have all the junk in it. It's yeah. just it's a solid moisturizer. Clean. So exactly. So a lot of moisturizers that you find they have they're like loaded with I don't know hyaluronic acid or things that you're actually not supposed to use with 
With retinol? Yeah. So we have um, hyaluronic acid in a lot of our products. Do you have it in this one? No. Okay. You no. guys, I've moved on to the eye <laughs> area. I am now using the anti-aging eye cream. This is our pot of gold. Look no further. I, I, this actually reduces the appearance of dark circles. And, and, and wrinkles. Fat bags, and fat right? bags. And the appearance of fine lines and wrinkles. It, Tap it in lightly. It's got uh, Swiss apple stem cells in it. Um, and it's this is an amazing product. This is a beautiful, beautiful eye cream. Come Just on. tap a little. You can actually use it on your eyelids. You can use it. <laughs> You can use it on, what does it say? No, 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 that's okay. <laughs> you can use it on your eyelids because we don't use chemicals in the product. So that is why we, you know, Honestly, most eye creams, they will say you can't use, you can't use eye cream on your eyelid, but not ours. Wait, mom, we, that's a we good recommend. idea. What is the idea? I can't read. Jackie said, will you ever make a vaginal cleanser that is toxic free? You yes. don't, no, you don't need it. Oh, okay. Just use a, a but it's like a self cleaning soap. apparatus. Our body wash, Naturally. our body wash is that's what Zanny all oh, look, mild soap. What? That's what <laughs> yeah, that's what it Zanny mild... always said. She's like, you know, when you're using a body wash, you you want if you're using something on your most private areas, you want to make sure it's organic yeah. and toxic free, no which our body thing. washes are. You can beat around the bush. Because... You don't have to get up in it. Well, <laughs> <sorry>. <laughs> I didn't hear it. I can't believe I just said that. <laughs> uh, mild soap. It sounded more like elegant in my head. Okay, guys, <laughs> I'm already ready. I'm ready to go do. Hey, why don't you go put on your dress? Makeup. Yeah. Should dress. I do the same? Yeah. So, you guys go put on your dress. I'm Daddy's gonna need gonna to dry in. these bangs. But come so, back. Come back when you're. Dressed. I will come back. Okay. Goodbye, yeah, guys, okay. for now. Yeah, we, we were... Come over here, dapper, dapper husband of mine. Come over here. I, Tammy oh, said, Bruce, this, yeah. you look very nice. Doesn't he look Thank great? you very much. Oh, yeah. okay, he's... See, I'll stand. Okay, well, you look great. You look like a model. Well, thank you. Yeah. So, those are the six pieces. Um, again, that six-piece kit is 50% off. It, the retail value is 269 and you get that home for $135. Six up. pieces, $135. And then the four piece is 42% off. And it doesn't work uh, on the other one. Uh, the four piece, just do this one. Uh, okay. The four piece is 42% off. You're still on six piece. Here's four piece. Four piece. And that one is... Normally $190, and you get four pieces for $110. So, of course, and you guys know you get free shipping at $100. Bucks. SuzanneSummers.com. Um, I just want to remind everyone, we all see promotions for clean beauty now. But when our founder, our queen, our mother, the pioneer, Suzanne Summers, when she started this, she was, she was alone on the hill. And a lot of places that we would go to to talk about it, they'd say, well, we don't want to talk about organic and toxic-free skincare because then it denigrates all of our other products. So if you go on there and talk about, like, this is organic and those other ingredients are bad for you, then it's not going to be good for our other product lines. And we're like, well, shouldn't people have the option? Shouldn't they know that there is a cleaner alternative this is like, have you guys seen all the protests going on for Kellogg's right now? Have you seen this, Bruce? No, I haven't seen it. Oh, okay. So they're finally, America is waking up because our food supply is much more toxic because they don't allow a lot of the, the dyes, a lot of the artificial dyes that they use in common breakfast cereals that are targeted to children. They don't allow those dyes in other countries. So... Their products are a little better that they sell over in Europe. Our products here, they're loaded with all these dyes. Well, they're, they're dyes that have been banned in other countries because they are dangerous and harmful. Same thing in skincare. We have carcinogenic sodium lauryl sulfate that you are allowed to put in every cleanser, and we have it all over the place, but it is a known carcinogen. Like, why is it still allowed? But Suzanne, she was always the one. She would take the slings and arrows. She would go out there 
And if she learned about something, she would share it. And then she would look at me and say, can you create a product line so that we can all have this? Because I tell my ladies, but they don't know where to get it. So that has always been our business model. Suzanne would go out, do this incredible research. She'd look at me and go, we need to. And then I would take my little to-do list and voila. So here we are with these incredible products that we're 15 years out. How long have you really been hearing about clean beauty? Not that long, not that long. I would say only in the last few years has it become more common. I feel like we need to show everyone where we are back here. I agree. I was waiting for you. Okay. Because, you know, now we've, you guys know what the products are now. Now we can just have fun in okay. the wine country. Cheers. Mm -hmm. Can I turn the camera around mid, mid? Uh, this, yeah, well. Right, so, yeah. Just turn it. Okay. Oh, oh. What happened? You get it? Yep. So hold that. Okay. Stand. This is where I, well, kind of where I grew up, Northern California. So we, I grew up just south of here in San Francisco, um, specifically San Francisco and Sausalito before it was the hip expensive place that it is now is a sleepy little town. It was the like town, town right? it was, and it was, it was the town at the other end of the Golden Gate Bridge. And now it's quite expensive. I couldn't afford to live there. There's Caroline, tiptoe through the tulips. <laughs> so the wine that the uh, hotel gifted us <laughs> so the wine that the the hotel gifted us when we arrived is from these vineyards and in fact these vineyards have been here longer than the hotel and uh um so the wine is about nine years old which is right around the sweet spot when you want to drink a rich nice. cab I mean, yeah most of the time when a, most of the time when a hotel gives you like their house wine you're like <laughs> Yeah, that, yeah. That's so nice. I this like, <laughs> Damn. Yeah. I mean, it is a four season, so. Right. Their standards are a little higher. Though. Yeah. Um, so, tell me what your memories are of growing up in Northern California. Well, um, in Napa Valley, all I knew was that we would drive up. It was usually cold, so obviously we were here in the winter time, mm -hmm. and my mom had a VW Bug a little beige VW bug. And I was so small, just to put things in perspective, that you know that little bucket behind the back seat, underneath the rear window? Mm -hmm. There's a little bucket in there. That's where I would sit. <laughs> and, oh, times were different. Exactly. And Now we're worried, like, do you have the car seat <laughs> at the right length on her shoulder? Yeah, yeah. I had a car bucket. <laughs> wow. And... Uh, um, the only time we came up here, this is where Alan expanded our life because my mom wouldn't do it um, on her own. We would go to Yosemite and go camping and we'd go to Lake Tahoe because that's where like my family would meet and we'd get like a little cabin or a tent or something like that. But up here, this is where Alan brought us and we he would drive um, the, uh, the VW Bug and uh, um, I'd sit in the back of the Bug, in the bucket. <laughs> wow. So... The first time that I came to Napa was after I was in college because I went to UC Berkeley. That's where Bruce and I met. Yep. And my dad would come up, and my dad loved wine. So he came up, and we went. Um, he said, let's go up to Napa for the weekend, which we did. And he said, I want to take you to this really special little winery. It's called Gurgage Hills. So a lot of you know Gurgage Hills. Like the Gurgage Hill Chardonnay in the 80s was like, that's the queen Chardonnay. Like if, if you, if you had the money and liked a good Chardonnay, it was like, I'll take the Gurga chill. So he took me to this beautiful winery and it was really small and really special. And we were sitting having lunch together and I, I just love my dad so much. So, and he was so, my father was very handsome. I mean, I didn't 
look at him that way because oh, he was just my dad. But he was he was a silver fox. Yes. So he was probably He looked like Giorgio Armani. So if I was twenty, he was maybe fifty five, like probably about your age now. Yeah. So we're sitting and He was I'm more like, handsome than I am. No, I'm, <laughs> I, I'm I holding think... his hand and I have my head on his shoulder and we're just like had the greatest lunch and he said to me I'm going to buy a case of this Gurgach Hills um, wine. And he said, and when you graduate from college, we are going to have this at your graduation party. So it was like always this like really special, special moment. So when we got up and we were checking out and he was buying the wine and, um, and there were these other, you know, women, all these women at their little tables enjoying their little Napa lunch. And they were kind of, you know, doing just talking. So when he went to pay for the bill, he said, oh, he said, I'm sorry, I think you've given me the wrong bill. I think this bill belongs to these lovely ladies and they seem very nice, but um, he's like, I, I'm, I have a very jealous daughter, so I'm not going to pay for their lunch. And they said, oh, it's your daughter. <laughs> and, he said, and they said, well, we were thinking, and he goes, I know what you're thinking. You were thinking he's a dirty old man with a young woman. <laughs> and it was just, we had such a big laugh about it. And sure enough, it was about three years later that I graduated from college. I had then met the love of my life. And we shared that beautiful wine at my graduation lunch. Love that. So, yeah, it was great. It was special. So that that's my, like, big memory. I also had, the only other time I was here was um, between the time that Bruce and I started dating and that lunch with my dad. Oh, here I, it comes, people. I was with um, a former boyfriend, a boyfriend <laughs> from high school. And he went to school in Northern California as well. So I had had this great experience with my dad, so I wanted to recreate it with my boyfriend. So I was like, okay, well, I have to take you to Gurgit Hills because that's like the best Chardonnay. So here I was like, you know, newly educated and and feeling fancy and loving this. Miss so, sophisticated. Yeah. So I took him to Gurgit Chills and again it's a very small winery and it was very exclusive. And so we did we did a, a tasting. So I'm like, isn't this good? Isn't this great? This is this is the Gurgit Chills Chardonnay. And I'm I'm feeling very feeling myself very fancy. This is what my ex boyfriend does. He goes has kind of a wang to it. <laughs> he didn't pass. Oh, and then I gave him some pate. Uh, here it comes. <laughs> I gave him some pate, and he literally did a... <laughs> Don't ever give me that again. It's like, it's like the was, scene from Big when he eats caviar. Yeah, yeah. So that was the beginning of the end for the high school boyfriend. Okay, so now I'll tell an uh, old girlfriend story. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> you I just actually did tell an old girlfriend story. I did. Yes, at lunch. Oh, at lunch, not on this. Oh, yeah. <laughs> the, he was, he was just, in Napa with an old girlfriend as well. Just for the record, I actually really liked Caroline's old boyfriend. I am very close with your old girlfriend. She's. It's not a competition, Caroline. <laughs> <laughs> anyway. Um, so I'm trying to stall because I wanted you to see the girls all dressed up. I don't think that's going to happen, to be you honest. Don't? No. Hey, Camellia Violet. Hey, girlies. Are you dressed? Here, I'll do a screensaver. Napa Valley. If you are can, can possibly get Facebook and Instagram on at the same time, you'll actually see a panorama because I have them side by side. Just put your dress on. Okay. Is Violet dressed? Classic us. A day late and a dollar short. <laughs> we're just, we, we had a little bit of a, they, they looked at us when we checked in and they said, I'm sorry, but your room will be ready at 4 p.m. And I was like, um, that's going to be a problem. We're going to need you to be in a little bit before 4. So they. We got it at 3.45. Three, yeah. And I said, I need at least 10 minutes to get ready. And it was like. You know, we're at full capacity. I'm not sure we can do that. And I said, we have a million followers, and I'm doing a show on Instagram and Facebook. Do you think you could get us into a room by four? They did. But that's why Violet has wet hair. But it kind of worked out well, because then she could use all the skin care. Yeah. Camellia just gets a pass. Camellia doesn't even know what country she's in. 
So. I'm not that far behind Camellia this week. That's true. You just got home from Korea. But I, I gave myself a couple of days to recuperate. Yeah. Okay. So it does not look like we're going to have... Um, Violet, are you... Oh, oh, look. Camellia, I see. She put on a dress. That is a good girl. <laughs> She is a boss. She's a little boss. She's a little boss. You know what? Great quality about Camellia is you could take her to Buckingham Palace, and not only does she know how to act, but she knows how to interact. She could sleep on this gilded bed, and if you took her camping and you had a cot, she'd be just as happy. Yeah, it's true. It's a it's a superpower. You wouldn't think this, um, but when the four of us travel, you think I'd be pretty. I think I'd be pretty easygoing. You think Violet would be pretty easygoing? Violet and I are kind of the ones that go. <laughs> yeah. I mean, I can do it, but. But Camille and I are always the ones that go, this is fine. This is great. Oh, yeah. Well, Camille's sweet, too, because if the place isn't great, she goes, but I don't want Teddy to feel bad. And we, like, <laughs> planned everything. And so that's, I, I like that they are, have a lot of gratitude like that. This just happens to be where the wedding is. Yeah. So, you know, we're, we're not usually, um, look how pretty my girls are. We're usually more wow. like three seasons. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's kind of a sister hotel. Oh, we don't, even get, we don't even get a view of ourselves half ready. Yeah. We're still kind of I was, ready. I was just telling everyone that we don't normally stay in the four seasons. Typically, we stay in the three seasons. <laughs> well, your outfits are beautiful. Thank yes. You. We need to finish the makeup, and then we're off to our event. Off to so, the races. Yeah, you guys, thank you for joining us. Thanks for joining us. And I hope you enjoyed your brief little tour of uh, Calistoga, very close to Napa Valley. And uh, Leslie and Daisy are back on Sunday with a great show for you. So don't miss it. See you then. Bye. Bye. Bye.